everybody and welcome to the Dreamy Storytellers. I'm Bella and today I'm going to read you a story about Hector who is a dreamer and who loves to make pictures with some painting, cutting, sticking and a little help from his friends Hector's dreams might just come true. So please do join me as I read to you Hector, the Dog Who Drew His Dreams by Mark Barry and Sarah Aspinall. Hector was a dreamer. He dreamed of faraway places and in Hector's faraway dreams he dreamed of sandy beaches and he dreamed of blue sky. Hector got out his best colouring pencils and paints and he dreamed up a picture of a big bright red car. Then he stuck the picture on the wall. A little while later Hector's friends Poodle and Poppet arrived. Hector showed them his new picture. What's that? said Poodle. My big bright red car, said Hector. It's going to take me to faraway places. But you don't have a big bright red car, said Poppet. I know, said Hector. Shall we help you build it? said Poodle. That would be nice, said Hector. Later on, Hector was very surprised when his friends Squiggle, Herbert, Bob, Stamp, Crumpler, Gibbet and Knickknack turned up too. We asked them to come over to help build the car said Poodle and Poppet. Everyone agreed that there was lots of work to be done. Knickknack, Stamp, Gibbet and Crumpler cut out cardboard. Squiggle, Herbert and Bob glued. Poodle and Poppet taped. And Hector made lots and lots and lots of sandwiches. <laughs> After a lot of hard work, the car was almost ready. Hector fixed the last wheel in place. Knickknack, Stamp, Gibbet, Crumpler, Squiggle, Herbert and Bob all agreed that the big bright red car was brilliant. Ooh, ah, woo! Gasp! Wow! Ooh! Poodle and Poppet whispered, I suppose you will be leaving us now. Soon, said Hector. They all agreed that it would be very sad when Hector left. Later, when his friends had gone, Hector got out his best colouring pencils and paints again and he dreamed up a picture of some trees. He made a picture of some houses, a few little shops, a big blue sky, some clouds floating by, a big yellow sun and a seaside. Finally, the day came for Hector to go. Knickknack, Stamp, Gibbet, Crumpler, Squiggle, Herbert, Bob, Poodle and Poppet. All came to see him off in his big bright red car. You've made a lot of sandwiches, said Crumpler. 
I know, said Hector. A lot for just one Hector, said Herbert. I know, said Hector. Shall we all come too? asked Pootle and Poppet. That would be nice, said Hector. No faraway place would be any fun without my friends, said Hector. So they all pushed the big bright red car until they reached the faraway place with trees and houses and little shops and a big blue sky and floating clouds and a big yellow sun. Then they all had fun together at the seaside of Hector's dreams. And Hector, well, he was thinking about where his paints and pencils might take him next. I do hope you enjoyed and remember, dream big dreams. Bye-bye.